What's going on, Sports Wars? This is Ryan with Arkeapos and GeeksandGamers.com, and we have some news to talk about in baseball. Um, yeah, the World Series is going on. The Nationals are up 2-0 over the Astros, so uh, my prediction, Astros in six, isn't looking too great, but there's still a chance. But we got some managerial news. So the biggest one, uh, Joe Girardi, former Yankee manager, uh, won the World Series with the Yankees in 2009, is going to be the Phillies' new manager. Uh, now, Joe Girardi, probably the dude... Um, him and Joe Madden, uh, you know, this year that had the best resumes. Obviously, Joe Madden went to the Angels. Joe Girardi had his pick. Uh, Phillies, Mets, you know, where did he want to go? Uh, he goes with the Phillies. A lot of talent on that team. They obviously got Bryce Harper. They've got uh, some good pitchers. They got some great position players. Um, he decided that that was the best option for him going forward. Uh, so Gabe Kapler obviously got fired after two disappointing seasons. Uh, Phillies had a really bad year this year for them. They expected to do a lot more. They finished 500 with Bryce Harper in that $330 million tag. So he also interviewed with the Mets and the Cubs. Uh, Cubs decided to go a different route. We'll talk about that later. Uh, Girardi is 55. He went 9-10 uh, and 7-10 over his uh, you know several years with the Yankees. So... Um, there you go. Phillies fans, you got to be happy. Uh, that's probably who you wanted. Um, Padres also today. Um, San Diego Padres, that's where I'm at right now. They hire Rangers Jace Tingler as manager. Now, if you've never heard the name Jace Tingler, uh, you're probably not alone because many people in the media have never heard his name either. I had never heard his name until he was in this coaching search. Um, He's a very unknown. Um, so they went from hiring an unknown, really, and Andy Green, who got fired after several miserable years, to hiring another unknown instead of a guy like Ron Washington, who is in the running. So the Padres have hired Jace Tingler. He's 38 years old. He was the Rangers Major League Player Development Field Coordinator this season. So becoming manager of a team is a pretty big step up. He has done some, like, winter ball managing stuff. Um, but as far as major league experience, uh, pretty much zero, absolutely zero. Um, so Padres had another disappointing year. They signed Manny Machado. They signed Eric Hosmer last year, Fernando Tatis Jr., one of the best young players in the game, and they went 70 and 92. So not a good year for them. They moved on from Andy Green to another unknown. And then my favorite story, I don't know if it's exactly going to end up great, but, uh, Cubs hired David Ross as manager on three-year deal. So David Ross was the catcher for the Boston Red Sox for a long time, then went for the Cubs. He was on that Cubs team. His last at-bat ever was in Game 7 of the World Series. He hit a bomb, and uh, what a way to end a career there, winning a championship with Joe Madden. A lot of the guys on the team really respect him. It's going to be tough for him to make that transition from a buddy in the clubhouse, obviously well-respected, an elder statesman, but to the guy who's laying down the law. So it's going to be interesting. He has no managing experience whatsoever. But, uh, you know, that, that's the case. Everybody in there loves him. He gets along with everybody. That's not going to be an issue. He knows the Cubs organization. So that's not going to be an issue. But will he be able to do this? Is he going to get the most out of that talent that the Cubs clearly have that, you know, past couple of years, Joe Menz, it's been a disappointment. He only missed the playoffs, you know, last year. But uh, that wasn't enough for the Cubs franchise, evidently. So uh, that's it as far as managers go. Uh, what do you guys think? Uh, I know it's in the middle of the World Series. This news usually doesn't break like this. Uh, Major League Baseball tries to keep it on the down low. Don't want to overshadow the World Series. But what do you guys think about these managing moves? Are these guys the right fit for the job? Is there somewhere else you thought they would go? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe. Smash the like button. Ring the bell for notifications. And we'll talk to you guys later.